On 20 June, Georgian anti-government group Share Movement, with support of opposition parties, marked the one-year anniversary of the event with a demonstration in the Rustavelli Avenue. A year ago, this day a violent confrontation happened between a group of protesters and riot police, which resulted in more than 200 people injured, including about 80 policemen. Organizers tried to have demonstrators follow social distancing by stamping stickers on the ground which mocked Russian President Vladimir Putin. Nikamelia, member of the parliament, was among the speakers. He said after one year they are still in the battle to win the right to free election. Uh, but uh, nobody in his right mind in this world believes uh, in this propaganda, which comes from uh, the Kremlin, from Russia. Former President Georgi Margvelashvili stated that the message of protest is for the Georgian government to resign. This is a very important day and this is a very important message that people are sending to the existing government. This government is government of the past. They have lost all the connection with the people, they have lost all the trade and the connection to the people. This is a very clear message that they are, have to go. They have to leave because they are not representing the wishes and the ambitions and the emotions and the values of Georgian people. Historian and politician Grigol Gagelia reflected on the event's relevance to modern history of Georgia-Russia relations. When uh, we have had to fight for very basic rights, you know, for you know, equality, social justice, you know, rule of law, and I think that's a fundamental problem. We should be able to move on. We should be able actually to protest uh, on other issues, so social and economic issues, but we're not given the possibility to actually fight for those issues. We are making this, you know, circles, fighting for the very basic stuff, which is, you know, a rule of law, which is, sort of, you know, uh, which is against the state, which actually punishes its, uh, uh, you know, peaceful protesting citizens. So I think it's time for us to actually go forward and to actually protest uh, uh, against, uh, you know, issues that actually matter and we should be able to change. So our agenda is very limited because of the politics of Georgia. That's a fundamental problem. Despite the effort of organizers, demonstrators failed to maintain social distancing. The protest ended without any incident. Ismi Shahzadeh, Heydar Isayev, for Signal TV.